Oh, this is my favorite part. He's gonna sing. Y'all know what time it is. This is the part where we crank it up. Let's crank it up. Now here we go. People over there, what's up? You feel me? Stand up and say what's up. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? You can get with this or you can get with that. You better get with this. Cause this is where it's at. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? See, I be skipping and jumping, leaving the competition. I make them disappear like your favorite magician. And I ride it till the wheel fall off. I bounce back to back till their necks get soft. Most of the time you see me, I'm being simple. Then many times I'll be busting them up like a pimple. Stating my claim to fame. To be one of the baddest young brothers step foot in this game. And I haven't even started yet. You can better believe I take it off the show shot bet. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? From dropping bars to dropping the competition. Post Malone can blend music styles as well as fighting and definitely a master on the microphone. Well, Post needs to defy his hilariously low overall rating and have the performance of his career. Covered in ink, but ready to tattoo the opposition tonight. Look, I respect Post Malone's desire and passion, but it's going to be tough for old Posty to leave here with the W. An award-winning multi-platinum recording artist. After conquering the music industry, Post Malone is here to try his hand at competing in WWE. You know, we've seen stranger paths to WWE superstardom. As long as Post Malone puts in the work and takes his competition seriously, I see no reason why he can't be just as big of a success here as he is on the music charts. Ready or not, WWE Universe, Post Malone is here, ready to compete. And I guess the circus is in town because our truth is his opponent for the night. Oh, come on, Corey. You don't want to know what's up. I love watching our truth. He's been in this business 20 years, and his enthusiasm and attitude have never dipped once. He's doing his thing, having a great time. You're just upset because he's in better shape than you. Well, actually, me too, for that matter. Oh. <laughs> Here it comes. Nicely done. And now Post Malone has the momentum. Truth has to find a way to respond quickly. Insulting. Now, I don't know if there's any ounce of professionalism in an attack like that. What's going to give R-Truth an edge in this matchup and help him find the win? It has to be his veteran experience. R-Truth was getting it done in the ring before many WWE superstars had even laced up their first pair of boots. The more he puts that experience... Soaring! Good Lord! Taking flight! You want to talk about putting it all on the line? Always an extra risk when you dive ringside. Whip back into the ring. Look, just toying with their opponent right now. Having fun at their expense. Just mocking their opponent right now. Total disrespect. Just a continuous rush on our truth here. And Malone is firing on all cylinders. And Truth capitalizes there. Truth caught by surprise. Pulled back into the hip toss. And he wants nothing to do with any of that. Horsecrew calf kick. Oh, right in there. Post Malone 
hoisting up his opponent, going round and round and round into a powerbomb. Big time knee rocks his opponent. Wow. Go ahead, Byron. <laughs> Here it comes. Cover right hands. Boom. And now Malone is showing the damage of this match. <laughs> Knew what was coming there. He steps foot in the ring again. I can't believe it, I'm seeing Post Malone looking for a power instead of Cutter. It's all Malone's for the taking. Makes the cover. <laughs> An emphatic victory. That match deserves another look, folks. It's all over. Our truth brought down for the L. Never a doubt. Barely a moment's suspense. This one was about as lopsided as they come. The weapon of mass seduction is here. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Baltimore, Maryland, Stacy Keebler. Not only are her looks exquisite, her kicks are lethal. Legitimate athleticism. Well, Stacey Keebler is certainly taking a unique path to superstardom. Yeah, she did it her way. Here comes the sensational one. And from New Orleans, Louisiana, sensational. Driven to make people suffer and can intimidate any woman on the microphone or in the ring. A former WWE Women's Champion, she held the title for over a year. And Sherry looks ready to return to the top of WWE. She's not exactly afraid to enter a confrontation. And this won't be a cat fight. It'll be more like a massacre. Yeah, there's no mystery when it comes to Sensational Sherry. She makes her intentions known immediately that she's coming for you. Scary Sherry is right. And here's one of the most celebrated superstars of her generation, Stacey Keebler. A legitimate icon for the women's division and someone who always finds a way to win, sometimes by the craftiest, most underhanded means. A woman after my own heart, if I do say so myself. We'll see if that instinct serves her well here tonight. We see sensational Sherry in the opposite corner, but she won't be there for long. Sherry moves like a lion on the hunt. For your own sake, don't take your eyes off her. Sensational Sherry cannot be tamed. She cannot be controlled. And when she gets on a rampage, Sherry cannot be stopped. That's going to be a moment you want to forget it very soon. Turnbuckle's the only thing keeping her upright. Wicked forearm! Did you hear that thud? And an overbearing amount of offense against Stacy here. Sherry is really on top of her game right now. Oh! 
Bam! Driving down with the axe handle. Great response to Sherry there. Stacy finding a way to slow her opponent's assault down. Stacy tipping the scales a bit here in her favor. What attributes does Stacy have that make her such a threat in the women's division? Stacy just knows how to win a match. She has this innate ability to take advantage of a situation, even against the more skilled opponent. So if she's able to weather the storm, chances are she'll find that open. I don't have you walking funny. Sherry's in the grasp. Brought down with a DDT. Is it enough? A kick out before the referee can get to one. Staying in this Single leg takedown. They step over Toho. And she escapes the submission. Big boat. Oh, my goodness. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. What a barrage of stops. Kick to the midsection and now using the bottom rope to their advantage. Just agonizing pain for their opponent and enjoying every minute of it. To the outside. This could get wild. She heads out of the ring, but she needs to pay attention to the ref's count. Into the ring again. With the counter. Slam down. She's starting to drag a little bit. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. Climbing up to the top now. And now she's getting back into the ring. From the top, from the top, of the diving hammer strike. Incoming. Sherry from the top room. Is that what it takes to beat Stacy? Cover! Sherry got it. What a win! Now let's take a look back at these ladies in action. Here is your winner, Sensational Sherry! A rough night and tough loss for Stacy Keebler. My gosh, this has to be a terrible loss for Stacy Keebler. Respect her desire to compete, but Stacy's legs nor her will to win were enough tonight. Good news, everybody. The pit has just opened up. Ready to rock out and fight. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall. On the way to the ring at a combined weight of 488 pounds. Mush and Thrasher, the Headbangers. These guys set the stage for the Attitude Era. That's because the ring is their mosh pit. And tonight, they're ready to break some faces. The damn Dudleys at it again. Oh, baby, we are about to get it stream. And their opponents at a combined weight 
of 595 pounds, Bubba Ray and Demon the Goodly Boys. You never know what's going to happen with the Dudleys, except that someone's going through a table. Yeah, we know the Dudleys have held tag titles everywhere they've gone, but they always have something up their sleeves. Bubba and Devon truly raise the bar for brutality. Every match with them quickly turns into a brawl. Get ready for a fight that would make Big Daddy Dudley proud. One of the most unorthodox teams we've seen in the WWE. The Headbangers looking for a big win here tonight. You gotta love the energy these guys bring into the ring. Moss and Thrasher are full throttle from bell to bell. And that's not easy to keep up with in the ring. Yeah, Byron, we'll see if their chaotic frenzy is enough in this matchup. But when you look at Bubba Ray and Devon Dudley, you're looking at a pair of men who redefined what tag team competition, tag team excellence looks like for an entire generation. Unstoppable, unforgiving, unconcerned about splinters. All that has made the Dudley boys arguably the most successful tag team of all time. Saw that one coming, took advantage. Oh, and DDT! Missed the clothesline, the flatliner connects. Oh, compressed in the corner. Oof. Kick lands. What a barrage of stops. And repeated impacts like that will weaken you mentally as much as it does physically. Oh, a cheap shot right above the eye. He got whipped into that corner. Here's the tag. And now both these competitors just stomping away. What a knee! Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Lands an elbow. Elbow drop. In control here with a swinging neck breaker. Textbook. Oh, God. Bubba Ray seems unable to turn the momentum here. Bubba is being worked on heavily. He's starting to struggle here. This is when you have to take advantage of tag team rules and get yourself some breathing room. No good reason to stay in this right now. And Bubba Ray responds. Bubba Ray looking to get back in this. Dudley hoping to start a rush of his own with that attack. Placing them right where they want them into the corner. Running drop kick in the corner. Vicious right forearm. Connecting on the DDT. He's tagging out. Be quiet, guys. Like being hit with a frying pan. And he goes for the pin! An easy kick out there. It is going to take a lot more to keep him down. Fires back with a crucial elbow. Set it up. Nice neck breaker. Big boot to the gut and a thunderous forearm to follow. Big forearm. Hooked up. PDT.
Here he goes, right into the corner. Look at these vicious stops in the corner. Boom, boom, persistent barrage. Face wash. Mosh with all the momentum on him. Killer instinct from Mosh shining through. Setting it up. Nice neck breaker. Oh. Mosh trying to power up his opponent and does just that. Here it comes. Oh, he retaliates. He's getting fired up now, really feeding off this crowd. Lands the elbow. Just using their foot as a weapon. So ruthless. He's getting a little... He could pin his opponent right here. His arm shot off the mat before one. How on earth could he not keep him down for even one at this point? Oh, target acquired and destroyed. Set it up. Nice neck breaker. into the ring. Ooh. Up to the top rope now. Look at it in here. This could be it. What a fool. He had him dead to rights. Oh, oh what a kick. Ooh. Plans in mind from Thrasher. Look out! Thrasher with the stage dive. Did Thrasher get all of it? Oh. Does he have it here? Oh, finally got him. I can't believe this match is finally over. These gentlemen get after it. Here are the highlights. to be a tough loss for the Dudley Boys. Gives you hope for the future of the tag division. Great tag team action on display, guys. Well, this man is the self-proclaimed greatest wrestler on God's green earth. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Kansas City, Missouri, weighing in at 253 pounds, the King of Wrestling, Harley Race. Bow whether you like it or not, 
Harley Race is on a crusade to reconstruct WWE as he sees fit. Race displays incomprehensible brutality and will do anything to keep the crown. Classic rivalries with the likes of Hulk Hogan, Jerry Lawler, and many other legends. The message is simple. Kneel before King Race. Well, not everyone supports the King, and I applaud those who fight this corrupt monarchy. Well, Saxton, anyone who opposes the King has to contend with a vicious brawler who's also a superb technician. Honky Tonk Man is in the building. And his opponent, accompanied by Jimmy Hart from Memphis, Tennessee, weighing in at 247 pounds, the Honky Tonk Man. Claims the WWE Universe is a wonderful audience. They're not returning the favor. Oh, don't be cruel, Cole. One of the greatest intercontinental champions of all time is here live. Well, when the Honky Tonk Man is here, you always have to watch your back. He's willing to smash guitars on opponents' backs more often than he actually plays them. We know this man's accolades. Honky Tonk Man is ready to play his greatest hits. We got the bell and we got the Honky Tonk Man. Honky Tonk's never without his guitar and his overabundance of confidence. Take away the sequence suits and live musical performances. Honky Tonk Man's a ruthless competitor who will find any corner to cut. Honky Tonk Man couldn't care less about his opponent. For him, it's all about the money and the music. And then we've got one of the toughest men to ever step foot in a ring, Harley Race. You ask anyone in this entire business and they'll tell you no one takes or dishes out a punishment like Harley. The stories we've all heard of Race's enduring spirit in the ring have basically become the stuff of legend here in WWE. Now we get to see that legendary toughness firsthand. He has to be ready to take hits and roll with the punches until the right opportunities present themselves. Playing the waiting game, huh? I bet all race needs is one good shot to get things going his way. Harley must be getting phased by this attack. But race can't allow this burst to hinder him. First drop. Up high. Oh, look at the well-placed elbow right on the mark. Retaliation. Harley isn't taking this lying down anymore. Yeah, but Race needs to maintain some offense to fully get back in this one. <laughs> Knee right to the midsection. Honky Tonk Man is doing whatever he wants. Honky Tonk Man is backing up every one of his lyrics right now. was close to over. Solely focused on... Ooh. We know that taking out the legs is one of the most effective strategies in any match. And he's able to reverse. Ooh. A big kick to the gut. The clubbing forearm. Vicious right forearm. It's a rather 
crude facial reconstruction. That's not very nice. Face gouge. Oh, God. There was no issue with that attack. Hey, sometimes desperate times call for desperate. Honky Tonk Man looking for a little, a little shake, rattle, and roll. Is that all she wrote for race? Two. And this one is over. We've got some highlights from the last one queued up. Here we go. Here is your winner, the Honky Tonk Man. Honky Tonk Man's your winner. Harley Race might be one of the toughest SOBs we've ever seen, but he wasn't tough enough to get the win tonight.